Let's talk about white hate and prejudice and discrimination. So I don't even know where to begin. There's so many, so many um, incidents. But we'll talk about um, a trip to Walmart, shopping in uh, the store, and um, there was a group of white people who, they had their phones out, um, seeing some stuff. Um, I don't recall what all they said that day, but um, I do know that it was inappropriate. Um, let's talk about when I had a trip to Dallas um, in December of uh, last year, uh, going into January of 2021. So let's talk about when I took a trip to um, the Chick-fil-A off of Trinity Boulevard. Uh, it's a shopping center over there. Um, it has mm, a couple of restaurants and a hotel. Uh, but I, I walked into the Chick-fil-A. Um, they had a sign posted outside for hiring um, as well as a few other places. And I walked in there and uh, the two... Um, young white, it was a young white girl and a white guy. Um, as I approached uh, the restaurant on the inside and to my right, there were uh, some, they were white, they were sitting off eating and he told me that the dining area was closed and that I couldn't fill out an application on the inside. So um, he wrote something on a piece of paper, but it was, uh, it was not their website for, uh, we're applying for jobs. Um, I went down further. Um, it was off of Trinity Boulevard, kind of like straight. Uh, uh, the company I can't remember, uh, but I, I saw off the side um, that it was like fuel, and I, I had experience in that. So I, I went into that location and um, asked for an application and the lady said I needed to apply online at Coke. Now, that's the craziest thing I've ever heard. Um, and yeah, she was a white lady too, sitting at the desk. Um, trying to think of the other incidents that I had. But, yeah, white hate is real. Prejudice is real, discrimination is real, foolishness is real.